A new locally owned restaurant is just about ready to open in downtown South Bend. And South Bend Tribune columnist Heidi Prescott got a sneak peek. Hi there, Heidi. Diners have been waiting a long time for Tapestry to open, so why the wait? Hey, Jennifer. If, if you've ever finished a basement or renovated a kitchen, you probably know construction timelines. They're a moving target, and that's the case with Tapestry, but it's finally opening next week. It's inside the old Vine building at the corner of Michigan and Colfax. That's next to the Morris and Palais Royale. Um, the owners, they had a lot of work to do inside. Partition walls were removed, so now it feels bigger. Um, special window and wall treatments make it so that voices don't echo anymore. And they spent months building the floor with reclaimed wood that comes from the Studebaker factory. It certainly had a lot to do. Tapestry contains some real South Bend history there. So let's talk about the menu a minute here. It's Mediterranean, so that must mean tapas there. That's right. The menu has two parts, tapas and wine. Tapas are small plates, kind of like appetizers, and they can be eaten by one diner or you can order several and share with a group. We tried blistered shishito peppers. They were wonderful, and we tasted orange caramel flan. Amazing. Tapestry also offers a self-service wine bar, so if you like wine tastings, you'll want to check it out. Diners buy a pre-loaded wine card, and that activates the machine, and then you can sample away. There are 24 wines on tap. Wow, menu sounds great. Heidi, thanks very much. And as always, you can read the latest in restaurant and retail news in Heidi's column. It's on Wednesdays and Sundays in the South Bend Tribune and at southbendtribune.com.